So folk, let us now try to uninstall Goha 20, which is a stable version 0.5 from Ubuntu LTS 20 version. So to start with, let us, uh, here is my desktop. Let us go to the terminal and let us try to open the terminal. In the terminal, as you can see, I have to locate my root. I have to access to the root services within this Ubuntu system. Therefore, I have to type the keyword sudo su. Uh, here, here are the instructions on how to uninstall Koha stable 20 version from Ubuntu 20 LTS, which is a stable version of Ubuntu. So first, I already have shown you go to the terminal or command prompt, type sudo su, S -U -D -O -S -U. this will be a uh, super user which uh, and then uh, you'll have to enter your password and then we followed by the second step then third step and let us type the first step first sudo su here in my terminal i'm under my terminal now as you can see i've already given the super user it prompted me for my password and uh, i have to give my root password i cannot share with you but as you can see, I'm here in my root and library thing center. This is the name and of my uh, uh, computer uh, of the system. So uh, next, I am already inside the root now. So what I'm trying to do is let me try to find out the version of this uh, Ubuntu. Uh, here it says that I am ubuntu 20.04 which is lts long-term service support and uh, first step we already done now let us proceed to the second step dpkg and uh, i'm typing here this command is probably used to understand the list of packages which is uh, uh it has given me some error here uh, again let me type dot dot list i have made a slight error in the command and uh, these are the you know the list of all the packages uh, which i have either the ubuntu system has installed at the time of the installation of the os or the one which i have installed much later on my own so what here i'm looking for is the name of koha this is the koha version which is already installed 20.05 it is a long-term support uh, stable version old stable i think uh, uh, here we have koha dash common underscore common so let me try and uh, you know uh, use the step here a little bit slight mistake i've made there i'm making a correction dot hyphen it's it's not under uh, one just one hyphen it's double hyphen now let us proceed to the third steps here this is the name of the uh, koha uh, name of the packages which we have just checked from step two it is available in uh, the system so now what I'm going to do, as you can see, this is the dpkg. This is the command for knowing the list of all the packages which is installed. I have just made the correction uh, a while back in the word file, in the library office file. Now what I'm going to do next is uh, follow up with a step three. And step three, um, I'm back to my root again. I uh, just exi exiting that, uh, you know, list of packages installed. I'm now in my uh, root and I'm going to type the command number three. Uh, sudo space app dash get space remove koha common. Yeah, underscore common. And then I'm going to give here another command extra, uh, which is a purge command that will also remove. Let me extend my screen. Uh, purge command. This will also remove all the configuration file of Koha, and not just. Uh, in fact, you can just uninstall it using the sudo app get remove Koha command. And the name Koha command here is the name of the software. Uh, here it says on. Uh, okay, I'm getting some error here. Uh, which means uh, dependency tree building uh, done, unable to locate. Uh, it is unable to locate. Probably there must be some mistake with the, I think the packages name or something like that. Uh, let me try again. Okay, same, same thing. Let me give the semicolon also. No, it doesn't execute the file. I think there is some error here. 
let me just uh what i should do let me just go and check back the list of uh the name the proper name of uh yeah let me go and check back uh with uh, as to what is the problem actually regarding this particular command uh, because i think i have given the right uh command of uh, the right name of the packages i might have made some mistake while inserting the name of a package uh okay okay oh, oh all right all right here is the name of the packages uh the problem is with the hyphen okay here as you can see i've given underscore command underscore yeah i will change that to a hyphen now uh, let me try and mm, yeah let me try and uh, i'm typing here i've made a mistake by entering the wrong package name therefore i will change it i will insert the i will replace i will now replace the under score with one with hyphen because i have previously given underscore now i'm going to give a hyphen let me exit from here okay uh, we're back and then okay i'll just remove the underscore i'll replace it with uh, and now perch now let us try to uninstall voila as you can see all the file here these are all the translator the pearl the <clears throat> memory cache of koha and uh, a lot of things will be removed uh, yes why yes uh, do i want to continue yes i'm continuing and it is uninstalling removing koha common it is processing the triggers and then uh, it will purge everything the configuration file you see below here these are the configuration file not empty so not uh, removed okay so all the log file library file here are uh, already removed now okay that is the mistake uh, as you can see uh, we always live with trials and error and uh, here we are also making slight mistake and then just like I did for that uh, dbkg list packages of all the uh, packages we just installed here. Now let us try to check. Okay, the list of softwares and k. I already now know Koha hyphen common is the name of the packages which I installed. Now let me go to alphabetically wise. Uh, it is indexed alphabetically. Okay, all the software packages that you install into Linux. Uh, let where is the k? Oh, here is the k, and as you can see it has been completely removed now guys you don't have to uh, worry a thing because now it is already successfully completely removed from the ubuntu uh, 20 lts so yes that's it about uh, how to uninstall koha from ubuntu